blame fall in your name. Now it's long overdue, but I can't do it. See, to a fool on the show. I can't speak for a song, but I gotta believe. I'm speaking for more than myself when I say, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Wake us up, wake us up, wake us up, Lord. Bernie thought this was a giant dinosaur egg that hatched. That would be one big dinosaur. Oh, it sure would. Woo. Maybe it was an egg. This kind of like an egg hole right here. I think where something came out of. Yeah. Mom, get him. Careful, Johnny. You've been more sandals in a while. Don't fall and bunch of shit over. <laughs> I practice this. How'd you guys make it over this? That's weird. That's so scary. Are you filming like that? Stop. Get off. Come on. This is a really interesting fossil here. There's, you know, when you go caving, you see bacon and eggs in a cave. Well, there's like egg formations here too. And this is one very large fossil. Look at this. It's like a tree. Some over here, some really neat fossils as well. So we're here at Pyramid Lake in Nevada, and there's sort of a list that I keep of places that we wanted to see before we leave. And this was on that list. I read that this has some of the best fishing. I'm not a person that fish very much, so I don't know a lot about that, but some of the largest fish has been caught in this lake here. Also, this lake here is a remnant of a much bigger body of water. We went to a place that had marine fossils. It was way out and way out in the desert. So this was a very big body of water that now is only these small little lakes. Sad to say I cannot share this next location with you. We didn't realize there was a sign that said Ariel was close. So we kept driving past where the road was. We were trying to see the other side of the lake or how far we could go drive around the lake. We then came to this area where my daughter saw this amazing sight when she climbed the hill. Yeah. I don't feel a lot of heat coming off of it. That's your mind. I mean, there's heat coming off of it. We did not realize that this was tribal land. It was sacred land to the people. And unfortunately, it was closed to some disgraceful, horrible acts that people were doing. They were vandalizing the rocks, leaving trash. And then the last straw was when they took a cow, killed it, and threw it on top of this geyser. So they closed the land. Sad to say, this is not an isolated issue, and our public lands are in danger if things do not change. We hope that we can share with as many people as possible to preserve places like this for future visitation, or there will be no more places for us to go.